Everyone, we are the Berry Girls. And we've made it our life's goal to show you how to eat healthy and make, make it count. count. Welcome to the Berry Girls Kitchen. Today we're making something delicious and nutritious, red lentil pasta. I'm so excited about this. I am too. Let's get started. Let's do it. The first thing we're going to do is add sunflower oil yes. to a heated skillet. Yes. And the next thing we'll be adding is chicken strips. I and mean, these are pre-cooked, so it'll cook quickly. It's nutritional yeast, Italian herb seasoning, good minced garlic. garlic. And the next thing we're adding is chicken broth or your vegetable broth, whichever one you would like. Now, it looks very watery, doesn't it? But once we pop in those vegetables and that pasta, it'll absorb. Everything will come together nicely. Oh, it smells so delectable. And you just cook it um, probably about five minutes. So if you get the microwavable Ooh. bag, that's even better. Yes. And five minutes in the microwave, and that's just, once again, another way to have your meals delicious, nutritious, and minimal time. Yes, easy peasy. <laughs> Are you ready for the <laughs> I am red ready, lentil ready for pasta? It. So tell me a little bit about a red lentil pasta. You know, well, it's made from lentils, but it's just another way for me to have pasta since unfortunately a lot of people are unable to eat pasta. So this is the way that they can get their fix and it's gluten free. So why is it that some people can't eat pasta? Is it just about the way that? Um, it's all about the gluten. Okay. It's all about the gluten. Very good. The gluten. You're filling yourself with good stuff, so you're not going to have a slice of cake after. So if you have <laughs> your pasta and a salad and adequate amounts of fluid, then you'll be completely satisfied and you'll really oh, make it a healthy that looks meal. Phenomenal. That looks totally delicious. That looks phenomenal. And you're getting major amounts of protein. The chicken, the, the, the pasta, everywhere. The nutritional yeast is just layer upon layer. You will be of good very stuff. surprised. Yeah. Very surprised. So there's no need to add in shredded cheese or anything mm -hmm. in here because the nutritional yeast really gets you that cheesy, nutty flavor that you really are reaching for. So you actually cook this for maybe about a good three to five minutes and then let it cool and it's ready to serve. I could probably make leftovers. Exactly. Take it for lunch. Yes. In right. your living room if you're working from home. <laughs> <laughs> that works too. Yeah. It's beautiful, it's pretty, it's colorful and it's filling. I'm so ready to taste this. Let's taste Give it. Give it a go. Give it a go. How is it? It's too fine, but it's missing something. I know exactly what we need. The Berry Girl seasoning. Absolutely. Or you guys can use any seasoning you guys have in your cabinet. Just make sure it's delicious. Now let's mix it in just a little bit more. You have to make it count in everything you do with your meals. So use portion control. Yes, that is very important, guys. That all plays a factor into weight loss or maintaining your weight. So always a smaller plate, mm -hmm. not your typical. So maybe a salad size plate would be awesome. And there you go. And we'll add just a skosh of pepper. Yummy! And dinner is served. This looks fantastic. Doesn't it? Red lentil pasta. Come back for more nutritious and delicious recipes from the Berry Girl. Make it count. Berry Girls out.